One of the most powerful features in OneHub is our robust sharing and permission controls. This video will walk you through how to set permissions and share files and folders with people. In OneHub, you can share entire workspaces or specific folders or files. In this example, we'll share an entire workspace. From the Home tab, first identify the workspace you want to share and open it. Once in the workspace, click on the Share icon located in the upper right-hand corner. This brings up a window that will allow you to invite users to this workspace and determine their level of permissions. As you can see here, we've already invited a number of people with varying roles. Before we invite more users, let's take a look at what those different roles and permissions are. Permissions are one way to help keep your file secure by limiting how various users can interact with your content. Permissions are controlled by this drop-down menu. Permissions vary based on the role assigned. The higher the role, the more access others will have with your workspace, folder, or documents. If you have any questions about what permissions each role has, click on the question mark next to the drop-down menu. This will bring up a support page outlining all of the roles. Before you invite a user, you can make sure they will only see what you want them to see with the Roles view. Select the level of permission you want to preview and click on the goggles next to the question mark. This will show exactly what that user will see at that permission level. Since this person will only have download permissions, the Upload, Create, Move and Delete buttons are gone. Additionally, there is a folder called Contracts that is hidden and cannot be seen by the downloader you want to invite. Click on the X in the upper right-hand corner to exit out of Roles view. Once you are satisfied with your permission settings, add in the email addresses for every user you want to invite at that level. After all the users at that permission level are inputted, click the Invite button. They will receive an email invitation to this workspace at the permission level you have set. At any time, you can go in and modify the permission for any user in the workspace. You can also modify permissions on a granular level, adjusting permissions on specific folders and files. Right now, let's adjust permissions for an individual document. Mouse over it in the workspace and the permissions and sharing icon will appear. Click on it and adjust permissions for particular users in this document only. The rest of their permissions will remain the same. If you want to share content with someone who does not have a OneHub account and you are not as concerned about tracking the activity for that file, you can always create and share secure links. OneHub's sharing tools are a great way for teams to collaborate and an effective way to keep your sensitive data secure. For more information about sharing or any other OneHub features, feel free to give us a call or visit onehub.com for more information.